rising researcher Carolyn Witzman is calling on the federal government to make a move. Uh, we don't have that clip, but who we do have is Adil Danani. He is a real estate professional with Royal LePage West Realty in Vancouver. Adil, welcome, first of all. Thanks so much for taking the time. Thank you so much for having me. Okay, so record rental rates in June, $2,945 for Vancouver, for a one-bedroom unit. Are these average figures that we we're just quoting there in line with what you're seeing? Yeah, I mean, we've been closely watching the rental market across all of Canada's major cities, and they're really being squeezed, I think, at this point by a confluence of factors. I mean, we have, like you noted in your intro, the strong wave of immigration. We've got declining housing affordability due to rising mortgage costs. And then when folks get priced out of purchasing a home, these buyers generally shift to the rental market, which then further intensifies the competition for rental homes. And so Vancouver and Burnaby holding first and second place, close to $3,000 just to get your foot into, uh, into a one bedroom condo in the city. Well, and what are you seeing when it comes to that competition? Like, how is this affecting the process of even looking for a rental unit are people what are people offer are they changing their strategy are they is it all about bidding wars what are you seeing you know what's really interesting and i'm going to really touch on what's pushing the rental rates higher um you know i think in it was last month it was the month of uh june where canada for the first time officially surpassed 40 million people um mm -hmm. in the country and the canadian immigration department has now set further aggressive um, mandates of bringing in half a million immigrants every year until 2025. So while that's fantastic um, that we're going to see, you know, we have a culture of diversity and inclusivity, um, it's really going to put pressure on both home prices and it's going to put pressure on rental prices. And what it's going to do is all the major cities across Canada are seeing this. It's not just a Vancouver story or a Toronto story. It's all the major cities. And now what we're having is local folks, uh, folks that are now moving to our, our, our province are all competing for the same rentals. Similar to your, um, your house hunt or your house search, mm -hmm. um, these would-be tenants now have to get creative, either in their journey of um, what they expected to get um, and ultimately what they will settle for, right? Maybe they end up getting a smaller space. Maybe they end up going further into the suburbs than they had initially um, anticipated. 